So it's day four. We're just heading over to the skyline to go to Epcot. We're going to take it a bit easier today because uh, we never managed to do Boo Bash properly yesterday because I ended up being ill. I'm not sure if it was something they ate. Um, but I basically sat out for most of it while Claire went round, got some chocolate. I managed to see some of the cavalcades at the end, so that wasn't too bad. Um, Disney looked after us though. We actually, uh, we were quite nice and give us a refund. Um, so I got my money back on it, so that was that was pretty cool of them. But yeah, um, hopefully today goes a little bit better. So we're on the skyline now, heading over to Epcot. Um, and Claire's quite happy today because as you can see... We match, she's wearing the same thing and we're going to be nerds. Yeah. And he's going to hate it and I'm going to love it. Yeah, so like I said, um, we're just going to take it easy today because I'm not feeling great still after last night. Um, so we're just going to part around the world showcase probably. I'm probably going to eat more than him today, which will be... Yeah, I'll, just, I'll just nibble. So. Welcome. And we're in. Took the back entrance because of the uh, Skyliner. So it brings us out just by the France Pavilion. So we're gonna start there. So we've just picked up our International Food and Wine Festival passports. Basically, it's got lots of things to tick off as you do. Uh, clever, festival gift card, so you can preload it with cash and then or just so you don't, it as so you, you go don't around. overspend. Yeah. Um, but it, by the looks of it, they've got like different entertainment and different things that you can do and you can literally tick them off as you go. Um, and yes. then obviously it's got Emile's Fromage Montage. Um, and then, they're, ooh, gluten friendly. So That's good for you. Lot, lots for me. And then I think what you can do is you get five certain things and I think you get like a free doll whip or something at the end. I think it lists all the food, doesn't it? So yeah, yeah here we go. Yeah, all the food for all the different... Um... So you can tick off what you've eaten and what you've tried. Yep, yep. So we can start working through that over the next, what we're here a few times while, while we're here, aren't yeah, we? So... Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, I, I'm definitely going to try and get through all the gluten-free stuff because there's not that much. So I think it's doable. Um, I think most of the foods are open now as well because some of them... Some of them weren't supposed to be, but I think they're basically all open now. But uh, yeah. All right, we can start working through it. I'm going to take it easy today and not have as many because of uh, Mark. Yeah, I'm going to make up for his um, his inability to eat. You know, it's anything. I'll catch up on uh, on Wednesday. see the barges on the lake for the new harmonious show and they are I can see what people say when they say they're a bit of an eyesore to be honest there are actually a couple of photo passes before we get to France so we'll do that first welcome to France only a few, a few short strides away from England first booth we see with lots of nice food that well, I'm not really up to eating this morning so we're definitely coming back yeah so we've got Beauty and the Beast sing along in one minute so we'll start with that to the test. Tie your napkin round your neck, Sherry, and we provide the rest. So that was the 
sing-along done. Apologies for any bleeding ears after listening to us sing. Yes, yeah, sorry about that. That was fun. Yeah. It's always nice to sing along when I'm not being shouted at for it. <laughs> so that was good. We're going to check out the rest of France and then after that we'll move on to the... I want to see if I can find a galette. We can get a galette and then we can go and move on to Morocco next, Just I think. move on around? Yeah. yeah. So apparently we can't get in and get a crepe because you need a reservation and it's not open yet. You need to have a reservation which is annual pass holders only which is all sold out until the opening on the 1st of October then I'm guessing. Hi. Hiya. Bonjour. Ça va? Would you be able to do us a favour and say hello to Caitlin for us? It's our niece and she loves you. Well, you know, she's back home, so if you could do that, that would be England. wonderful. England? Yeah, so we've come a long way to get here. Absolutely. Hello, Caitlin, it's Michelle. I hope you're having a most enchanting day, and I hope to see you soon. Next up, Morocco. Okay, Let's see what a fez looks like on that head. What do I call it? A fedora? It's a fez. Yeah. You got a, have your little thing on the side. I got my little on the side? Yeah, yeah, there we go. That's, that's look, the badger. Look dashing. Uh, you look like you could be an extra in Indiana Jones. <laughs> Isn't that what you mean? An extra, not a, not a leading role? No, you need the fedora for that. I need the fedora for that, <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> Where are you going? It's big. Oh, yeah, I think it's no! No! I thought it was going to work then. I thought it was going to work then. Oh, it's alright, you, you can still pretend, babe. There we go. I'm doing it, I'm doing it! <laughs> He's got a prime spot in Morocco, in Epcot, and he's got the um. Gotta love the dad jokes, don't you? I cracked it yesterday, but it's a good one. Looks like they're doing some kind of testing on the barges in the middle for Harmonious. Next up, Greece. It's in something that you like. Cheese. Cheese. But it's part of the meal's cheese thing too. You can't go wrong with cheese, can you? So we've got the grilled cheese, griddled cheese. Yep, pistachios and honey. How is it? Good. No words needed. So we just got a stamp for getting that griddled cheese. It looks like if you collect five stamps for these five menu items you can visit shimmer in ships get some kind of prize so we'll have to have a look at that see if what we can do and see what it is so japan next which is my favorite stop so we can get bow buns if we want well i can claire can't this kochi lemon drop looks quite nice might grab that in a bit Go have a look at all the Japanese goodies in the shop. Oh wow, these are cool. Look at that. that is pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Gotta love a bit of Dragon Ball. Ah, oh, look at that. Look at that. Kawaii Zilla. We've got a we got a Goomba. That's pretty cool. You'd never get it home. Oh, look at the... 
Luigi. Ah, oh, it's not a wearable hat. It's just a Luigi hat. Pillow thing. Pika, pika. The Salaman. That's not an axolotl. It's pretty, pretty close. Cool. Pretty cool. We get you some helper chopsticks, Claire, so you can um, so you can eat proper. <laughs> Go on then after you. So we're in the Kawaii Gallery of Art in Japan. Gundam, Kawaii Gundam. Astro Boy action figure. There's that bit of 80s Japanese pop culture for you. Hello Kitty. Do you know Hello Kitty is one of the most, the biggest franchises in the world? Pikachu teapot and a Pikachu cup we need, and Pikachu kitchen utensils. We need those in our lives. Totoro shower curtain and a Totoro leaf bath mat and porcelain throne cover. Oh, look at the little Pikachu on his belly. Lay down on his belly. That's pretty cool. Almost as cute as you. Oh. Look how squidgy he looks. He's the laser panda. He's only by rolling over, unmotivated, and absent minded, then through relaxing in teacups and the growing size of the meters. Then very soft and he's fly by dividing into. He sounds like my spirit animal. So we're going to get a shaved ice. So we got the rainbow kakagori, which is shaved ice with a sweet milk topping. Looks quite nice, doesn't it? Looks weird. It looks weird. That mm -hmm. no, looks great. It does look great, but it also looks weird. Am I going in? You can go in first. Yeah. Dubious first mouthful. Yeah? Oh, that's good. Refreshing, isn't it? Yeah, I'm getting it everywhere. Mmm. Mmm. You can't have it, no, you can, I'll share some. I'll save you some at the bottom. So next up, America. Looks like we've got a show on. Just a few steps later, and we're in Italy. What an ass. Would you like to um, paint your own mask? You sure? Only thirty dollars. If they don't come out that quality, we're gonna have words. <laughs> oh, it's more my kind of mask. So 
so we're in Spain now. I think Claire's going to get the charcuterie. How is it? Spicy. Spicy. Is it charcuterie? Yeah, it's good. So we're in Germany now, which means we can get the Schinken Noodle. Schinken Noodle. I'm probably butchering that, but. Some more information about the fromage montage. So it's that one? Yeah. So I guess we're getting the Schinken Noodle. You are indeed. Let's do it. Right in my face. Have fun there. To be fair though, for Disney prices, that's pretty decent size considering it's only four dollars fifty. I mean, anywhere else that'd be tiny, but for Disney prices, that's not bad. Mm. Not bad. The Christmas corner. Claire's going to be well happy, ain't ya? Are those pickles on a Christmas tree? Yeah. More pickles. So we're just having a sit down and a break. Because this Floridian heat's just getting a bit much today. Yeah, I think that's the technical term, isn't it? Yep. Not gonna get as, as, around the world showcase, I don't have quite as many shops, so there's not as many opportunities to dart into air conditioning yeah. and stand in there. And because all the food stores are outside, you, but, yeah. you're, you're sitting outside. And uh, as Brits, when I used to the heat. Yeah. He wants to stop. Welcome to China. Time for some bubble milk tea. That is just what the doctor ordered. Cheers. Oh, that's divine. That's beautiful. Going in. Welcome. I am Li Bai, a poet of the Tang Dynasty, and I have returned to share with you reflections of my beloved China. Set your gaze across the Huangpu River and you will find a new China that reaches for the sky. Yet in this city of East meets West, one can still find treasures of Shanghai's stately European influence. In modern China, there is always time for Tai Chi, a tradition that has endured for centuries. We have had a long history. Much of it has been recorded in this fashion. However, it may be said that the history of the Chinese people is not written in ink, but with water. But I hope you will return to China someday. I'll wave of the hand now, and I am gone. Lowering my head, I dream that I am home. 
until we meet again. Sai-chi. First find the pandas. Do you want one? Is he cute? I was going to say, is he kawaii, but that's wrong country. How about a panda hat? How do I look? Banging. Totally adorable. That is... That's exactly the word I'm using for it. It's a ninja panda. Oh, we were in there doing that show. We're going to go uh, over to Norway now and hopefully get on the frozen road while it ra continues to rain. So apparently we're invited to a snow day celebration. And the sun is back out. So we're in Mexico now, and we're gonna go do the Grand Fiesta tour with the three Caballeros. Yeah. <laughs> 
It is hot. So we got a mango, mar a strawberry, margarita. Oh yeah, it's nice though. Next up we have the pork groins, which has got us another stamp in the book. Oh, pork scratchings. Oh, are they? Are they as good as the ones at home? Yeah? Ooh. So we're just taking a slow walk now out to the front of the, the park. We left out Canada and the UK because we've got a dinner reservation and an hour in a bit, so we're just going to make our way over there. So we're at uh, Kadani village now. We didn't finish the uh, fromage cheese stamp book. Uh, we've got two more stamps left, we'll do that on Wednesday when we go back. But we're just heading into the hotel now to get dinner at Sanar. Awesome, thank you very much. Where's my mojito? Yes, I'm going to go with the aluminum. I'll have the New York Street. How do you want to prepared? Um, I'll have it however they recommend. I'll have it. I'll have it maybe. So I've had the raspberry mojito. Yeah. Oh, that's good. That is very refreshing. Yeah, that is nice. It's proper raspberry as well. Sometimes yeah. it's raspberry, you can't really tell what kind of berry it is, but you can really tell. That's got quite a strong taste, doesn't it? Yeah. That is lovely, that is Red sangria with a secret hidden Mickey. Can you spot it? Can you spot it? Can you tell what it is yet? Can you tell what it is yet? I feel so mature right now. You are mature. sangria out of a Mickey head. Classy. That's what you are. Proper classy. Is it good? It is indeed. Even better for being on a show for me. These are your nine classes, they're all gluten free. Awesome. And then you got your gluten free bread here. Lovely. Yep, he's just giving us a little bit of a. Though she has forgot. <laughs> no, no, I was just saying. I'm just making sure that you Awesome, thank you very much. Yeah, probably best for you not to have those two then. Yes. If you don't want spice, but just gonna dig in. Hopefully, get a bit light with the oven, start going. Is that good? Actually, like a bread service for me. A decent gluten free bread service. Few and far between, aren't they? Yeah. I just don't get them. How would you rate it out of 10? Well, I've had like three mouthfuls, so so far, pretty good. It's like a mango. So this one's like a mango? That one's good. It is really hot. Oh, it's really hot to touch. So what's this one? What's this one? So we got this one is a brown one. Can't remember what it said. Oh yeah. Dinner's come. Claire's got the butter chicken and the... Uh, what was the other one? Aloo masala. Yeah, and that looks pretty good. And I've got the... You weren't lying when you said it was a good steak. It is a good steak. It's a very good steak. It does look good though. Look at those chips at the front. Oh, potato wedges underneath as well. Yeah, let's, a lot of beans, but that's alright. Let's try. Oh, look at that. Mm. That, that is a good steak. Mm. Mm. The potato wedges are pretty good as well. Yeah, well happy with that. How's yours? Really good. I'm someone who's from the Bulgari Triangle. This is good. Good.
going to kill me. And just to finish off the night, we've got the triple chocolate African mousse. Looks pretty, pretty good. I'll let you go first. I don't think I can eat much of this though, to be honest. I'll let you go first. Yeah? Good? That is good. You know, I say that, say that about everything, but that is actually pretty good. <laughs>